Hey, what's up, y'all boys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we back on Jujutsu Shenanigans, and in this video, I'm going to be showing y'all all the moves that has variants. I'm going to show y'all the original move, and I'm going to show y'all all the variants for it. So, if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure y'all leave a like, subscribe, comment, turn on post notice so you know every time I upload. Click the links in the description. Be sure to go to the Discord, because I have information on a tournament that I have coming up for this game. If you want a chance to win a free game pass, all you got to do is go to the Discord, go to the announcements tab, and make sure you stay active in that so you know whenever I... You know what I'm saying? Get that stuff started. So we're not going to do a lot of talking. Let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, so starting with Gojo, his first move that he have that also has a variant is Red Reversal. So I'm going to spawn the dummy right now and show you how to look. This is the non-variant and just looks like that. But if you use 2 and click R, it'll give you this animation right here. So that's pretty cool. Also, you have Laps Blue. Now, I don't know if you really would call this a variant or not. But basically, if you use Laps Blue, you can get this. But you can also use Laps Blue as this. And you get that little extra kick right there. So yeah, that's something for y'all that didn't know. Alright, so now we're going to move on to his ultimate. Because he do have another one that uses his ultimate. And I got probably the toughest ultimate fit in this game, bro. Okay, so what you want to do his ultimate form. You see how I have Red Reversal Max. Now there's two ways that you can actually use this. You can use it the regular way, which will look something like this. And you can use it with clicking R as well. And you'll get that right there. You see the little ball that comes out. That ball going to come out. And once it hit the target, it'll bring them to them. And you'll get you a little black flash. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. So, this one is a little special one, right? So, it's hollow purple, but there's different hollow purples now. It's not the same way you would do anything else. But you have hollow purple. What you want to do is use it. This is the first one. The, like, you know, the non-variant version, the regular version, or whatever you want to call it. You have that version of the hollow purple. And you also have this variant of the hollow purple. It'll look something, as a matter of fact, I need to spawn that one. Now, this one is called a Hollow Purple Max. So, what you want to do is use Laps Blue. And once this stays there, you want to use Red Reversal. And you'll get a Hollow Purple Max. Now, the only way you can actually use the Hollow Purple Max is if the target is low. So, the target has to die, and it'll leave the Laps Blue standing. Because if, if the target don't die, it'll just disappear that quick. But if it's a low target, the target will stay... And then you can just use Red Reversal, and once they collide, it'll create a Hollow Purple Max. All right, so moving on to Vessel, Sukuna, Yuji, whoever you want to call him. He has quite a few, so I'm going to show all of his right now. Now, the first one he has is Curse Strikes. So Curse Strikes non-variant looks like this. But there's also an Aerial variant, so it's called Aerial. So what you want to do is, let me apply cooldowns real quick. What you want to do is jump and then click Curse Strikes. And you'll get that animation right there. So that's pretty cool. And you have another one for his second move, which is Crushing Blow. It looks like this. But if you use the variant, which again is an aerial variant, you have to jump and use it. And it'll look like that. That's pretty cool. Now, Divergent Fist also has the variant. So like I said, Sukuna has pretty much a lot of them. So, you know, you use Divergent Fist. It looks like that. But you can also use the Black Flash. And it'll look like that. So that's pretty cool. Now, moving on to his ultimate. He has, I think this one is actually new one. I think there's only one he has for the ultimate, but you have this mantle. So if you use this mantle non-variant, it'll look like that. But you can also, I don't know why the cooldown is not applying, but you can also jump and use it so it'll look like that. But pretty much all of his variants are like aerial variants. So all of his moves like this mantle and curse strike and all that stuff, you have to jump to activate the um variant. So yeah, that's that. That's pretty cool. I'm pretty sure that's all the ones that he got. So we're gonna move on to the next one. All right. So next person we got is Restless Gambler. So what you want to do with him? You see how I have a rest ball. I can use that, or I can use shutter doors, or I can use them both. So basically, what I want to do is one and click two, and it'll do that just like that. So it's basically a variant for shutter doors and reverse balls, I guess you can say. But yeah, like again, I'm gonna show what you do is one and then click two, and whenever the bullet hits, it'll do shutter doors. But basically, this is what it looks like on variant. I don't think I can't remember if I showed it or not. That's reverse balls, and this is shutter doors. And again, you click one and two, and you'll get that right there. And that's all he got for the rest of the gun, bro. He don't have anything for the alt that can um do variants or anything. So we're gonna move on to the next person, which is perfection. Now perfection does have a couple of them. So his first move, stockpile. It looks like this on variant. But if you use his aerial variant. Which again, you have to jump and activate. So it'll look something like this. So yeah, that's pretty cool. He also have another one for focus strike. So focus strike looks something like this. This is a little 
good little stun. You can also use it as a black flash, you know, but you can also use it as a chain. So you want to click three and click R and you'll get a little chain right there. So yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, so that's all for perfection. Now we're gonna move on to the next person, which is, did I skip 10 shadows? I skipped 10 shadows, I didn't realize that. I'm sorry, I skipped them. But we're gonna move on to 10 shadows, which is the last person. Now 10 shadows, this actually just got added uh, yesterday, I believe. So um, this one is also new, like the other ones. So uh, we're gonna apply the cooldown. And then basically what you have for rabbit escape, this is what it looks like on variant. And you also have this variant, which to activate, you have to use his special ability. Now you want to click R and go up to the target while you're in the shadow. And okay, I messed up. And click one and basically it'll pop out like that. So that's pretty cool. Now you also have another one for his second move. And basically what it looks like is the bird will come out like that. But if you click two and R, you'll get that right there. Now you also have another one for the third move. So the third move, you click three. It's a little toad that'll bring it to him. Or you can click three and two. And you'll get these right here and they'll throw him up into the air like that so yeah that's also pretty cool all right y'all boys so that's gonna be the end of that that's all the variants i have for y'all today if i missed any let me know in the comments because i'm pretty sure i got them all but i probably did miss some so if i did just go ahead and let me know in the comments and i'll be sure to make another video updating y'all on those too so i appreciate y'all for watching if y'all enjoyed the video make sure y'all leave a like subscribe comment turn on post no yourself no every time i upload remember go to the discord because i got a tournament coming up and if you want to be a part of that tournament it's very simple to join literally it's very simple as i approach 5k i'll do a live stream and i'll post the server link when i post the server link you just got to be the first 20 to get in there because you know that's the max amount of people they can be into a game so you just got to be the first one to get in there and hey that's it you want to be alerted for it turn on notice and go to the discord so that when i post the link when i start the live i'm gonna tell y'all so if you want to be a part of it, that's all you got to do to turn on notice and go to the Discord. But anyways, I appreciate y'all for watching and I'll see y'all in the next video.